On uVisit.com, you can click and drag your way through a number of videos and feel like you're really there. Like my favorite way to vacation, walk along the deck of the Carnival Breeze cruise ship. Or plan out your next 12-hour trip with amazing detail down to the hour thanks to 12hours.net. When I get lunch in London, I guess I'm going to Elliot's. Hello, I'm Nikki, and you can visit the craziest of places without ever having to leave your home thanks to the power of Dom. Things you can do online now, guys. Simply search for Ride POV in YouTube and you'll find yourself buckled into several thrilling roller coasters. Why spend all that money on theme park tickets when you can experience these first person points of view? You can even ride in the front row. I personally hate that drop feeling in your stomach, so let's stick to sightseeing. Airpano.com features stunning views of beautiful places like Iceland, Spain, and Brazil. Click and drag your way through expansive panoramic views of amazing landscapes, some offering you alternate angles safe from a helicopter, all in a virtual 360 degree experience. I wonder how far away this is from. Hmm. Furthest city helps you figure out, well, the furthest city. Select a place and it will find the furthest city with a population over 100,000 from, say, New York City. Choose your country and city and it looks like it's down under. Perth, Australia. My life sure would be different growing up in Australia, if it were my home. Dot com. Figure out what that would be like. By comparing the US to Australia, I'd be less likely to be employed, make less money, have a lesser chance of getting murdered, and in turn would live two and a half years longer. But I'm afraid it might be too hot for my liking. Nothing like bundling up on a cold night next to a fire. Thanks, Snowy Escape. The nice break needed from when you're on top of Mount Everest. You might have already climbed Everest in this dawn we featured before, but this dawn takes you on a virtual experience all the way up to the top of the summit with a full 360 degree turn. Hello! Hello! For more cities with the view, 360cities.net is a website of panoramas from around the world, nicely laid out on a map. Pick a country and see what panoramic views you can explore. Hey look, people are rope jumping. Now I know a lot of these views are outdoors, but what are some of the most beautiful places to visit indoors? How about the Sistine Chapel? That ceiling is quite marvelous in virtual person, let me tell you. I can cross that off my bucket list, well, my dong bucket list. And let's see the world through a different lens. How about an edible one? Fastfoodmaps.com rolls out the most popular fast food joints in the USA, perfect for planning your next road trip. And while you're driving, be sure to pull over and smell the air and eat whatever you can on the side of the road. I mean, I love me a good burger and fries, but fallingfruit.org provides a healthier choice than fast food showing you what kind of yummy plants you can find in which cities. You can even filter your search by, say, apples, stone fruits, or freegan. If it's free, it's for me. Dumpster dive, build your immune system, and avoid the flu, Lyme disease, Ebola, and more diseases with the help of healthmap.org. I'm not sick very often, so I'm gonna take my chances with MapCrunch. MapCrunch will teleport you to a random spot in the world using Google Maps. Maybe one will catch your eye faster than you can catch a cold. Anyone can get lost using Google Maps all day, but say you're not much for teleportation. You can also use Frame Synthesis, a game where you can drive through Google Maps. You can choose between a sedan or a bus, and you can even put your hazards on. The bus is a bit slower, but it all reminds me of Grand Theft Auto 2. Ah yes, the virtual road trip you've been waiting for. Drive across the land and ocean? But if you were to pop in your Tron Legacy soundtrack, who needs a car when you can experience New York City as a Tron bike map? Buildings are mapped out in blue, while traffic patterns are beams of light, all on top of a wireframe of Manhattan. New York, the city that never sleeps. And it doesn't matter what time it is, I always find myself in traffic. Unless I take it to the sky. Check out every airplane flying around the world right now with Flight Radar 24. They actually move in real time, and you can actually click and find out more information, like what flight it is and the actual plane. But what about things falling from the sky? Geology.com navigates 50 of the world's most obvious asteroid impact sites globally. To be honest, that's a lot more than I thought there would be. Hey, there's even one in Brazil, right in the Amazon, which is one of the many locations you can witness a time lapse of over the past three decades on world.time.com. Take a look from above, peer into the past, and witness the evolution of Las Vegas, Dubai, and Shanghai to name a few. Okay, a lot of these dons are really making you antsy and itching to physically move. Before you go, it's not too late to start partaking in the awesomely popular geocaching.com, a website that takes you to places around your home in the world's biggest scavenger hunt. 
After making an account, you can enter in your location and this website will show your geocaches or treasure chests around your area. Use the coordinates and clues entered to find these tiny treasures. They might just be in the form of an Altoid box magnetized to a streetlight with a keychain in it, but you get to take something from the box and put something else in as a souvenir for the next adventurer. Links to all dons can be found in the description below. I'm Nikki, and as always, thanks for watching.